Our next topic will be on intravenous therapy and uh, blood transfusion. First, let's discuss the ABL classification system. So remember that blood types are classified as group A or type A, type B, type AB, and type O. So the ABL classification system classifies blood according to the antigen that is found in the blood. For example, for type A blood, the antigen for that is A. For type B blood, the antigen for that is B. For type AB blood, the antigen for that is A and B. And for type O, it means to say that there is no antigen. However, for type O blood, the antibodies for that would be anti-A and B, which means to say that you cannot give type A or type B blood for a type O patient because he has antibodies against those. A type AB has no antibodies, and that's why uh, you can give any blood to a patient with uh, an AB uh, antigens. Type B has antibodies against A, and type A has antibodies against B. So it follows that when the patient is type A, you can give type A only, or O. For type B, you could give type B or O. For type AB, you could give everything because it has no antibodies. But for type O, you should only give O because it has antibodies for both A and O. So let's try to summarize. Type A can receive type A and O. Type B can receive uh, B and O. Type AB can receive everything. It's the universal recipient. And type O can only receive O. But remember also that your type O can be given to any patient. So this is the universal donor. Okay, so this ends our lecture presentation and thank you very much everyone.